Hi, my name is Rashid and I play the guitars. I'm Vijesh, I play the drums. Arif or vocals. Myself, um, the guitars for this album, I try to um, emulate um, um, melodic crust, neo crust, and I like bands like Fall of Half Rafa. And um, uh, playing styles, uh, guitar playing styles of um, Gridling uh, Discordant Axis. Yeah, those are the major ones, those two. Because for me uh, personally, voices is more melodic. Um, I just try to infuse more of these octaves into my playing, which is, I guess, it's a challenge for me because I am a single guitarist and I have to cover both guitar and the bass parts. So to, um, to develop a style that covers both is quite challenging for me. Yeah. For me, it's like uh, I was new to grindcore, so the, um, the main influence uh, was those guys who were really good in DB, especially uh, Byron Luders from uh, uh, Weekend Nachos. Uh, yeah, my DB is really inspired by him. I got him to thank for you know all that, and Chris Moore. Um, 
yeah, all those uh, top grind drummers out there, I kind of tried to learn from watching them and try to develop my own style in that sense. Um, as vocal wise, <clears throat> I'm, 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 I'm really a fan of uh, this band called Insect Warfare. Um, his name is Rahi. I just love how he handles the high range and the low range. Um, I tr in all albums, I will try to be as, um, as, as dynamic as possible, as different ways like highs and lows and mid range and shouting vocals. So as the album won't get too dull, so there's variations to the album. So um, I'm still learning along the way whether I have another set of range to explore, uh, like spoken words and all that. Um, it's a good thing because um, it really builds up your stamina when you play live on stage. So bands like Insect Warfare, uh, bands like A Good Grind, um, bands like, I don't know, cross bands like Tragedy. Um, I'm always a fan of really powerful vocals. written since ever since um, ever since the last tour that we did which is which is 2012 uh, where was it uh? Europe was Europe it? yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, during that Europe tour we already had songs then uh, which is uh, on voices now so we were writing like consecutively like slowly 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 so um, well it's a collection uh, which is it's a natural progress uh, of um, collection that um, we didn't we didn't force it out. We took our time, just like how we did abuse. Uh, abuse also um, took us like probably like two years, right? Two years to write slowly, uh, and this one took us about five years to write slowly. <laughs> yeah. yeah. How are you guys doing tonight? All right.
It's been so fucking long, probably five to six years since our last Euro tour. So thank you to everyone for turning out tonight. Cheers, man. So every album we treat it as a diary, whatever whatever happens on tours, whatever happens on our personal life, we'll, we'll put that in the album. So it's more a personal touch to the album instead of going, I mean, F the government or whatever, we, we are not that kind of band. Um, the genre is still grindcore but the lyric wise and everything is still, is about us. I think it's more meaningful that way. We choose about uh, we choose to write about uh, what we experience every day, uh, not necessarily political. Maybe just everyday life, and meeting uh, shit uh, shit kinds of people, and we talk about uh, talk shit about them, or yeah, just about everything else. Um, we 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 might have like one or two political tracks, but mm. it's not really directed um, about a certain. Topic is just in general, yeah.
Um, so far, it's been really good, man. It's, it's I, I, I'll probably say this is our best experience yeah. of a Europe tour, man. Okay. Um, everything, I have no complaints about this tour at all, man. Yeah, because the last tour was back in 2012. And to compare it back then to now, so far, it's been so much difference. So hence why we are so grateful everything I don't want to jinx it but everything is so so good right now <laughs> yeah as compared to back then we have a lot of problems back in 2012 but for now everyone is so supportive of us and we are very thankful for their um, for their patience <laughs> for waiting for us for five six years to come back to Europe so yeah and for good. this one also we are only doing for two weeks so I guess we won't be as tired because the previous time we, we, we toured for like one month, two months yeah. and yeah, it really took a toll on us. It really like dampened our moods. We, we, were, we were pissed off and shit. Um, but for this one, it feels like a holiday also because it's just two weeks. Uh, yeah, and uh, we can only afford two weeks uh, because of our day jobs back home. So, yeah, it's been fun, really. Yeah. I guess the, the huge difference is that the the people in uh, the Europeans and the Americans also don't see us uh, very, that often. So, like for example, we come once in five years, so they they are more excited. But that's not saying that um, the Singapore crowds aren't ex excited also. It's just that. Um, I guess uh, the Europeans and the Americans get to you know let go of all this. They have this release. Yeah. So at one point of time, so yeah, because they have not seen us for a very long time. But while in Singapore, the 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 person who 
those people who went to our show, we, we almost meet them every day. Um, we hang out and chill and drink beers with them and all that. But as compared to Europe and US, they, they, they don't see us every day. So hence why maybe they, it's, it's the right time for them to gather and celebrate so often. Yeah. This yeah, by the time you watch this, we already destroyed this place. <laughs> 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 so, I mean, um, the, the, the tour has been great so far, and we're really looking forward to play tonight at Berlin. Um, we'll be finishing our tour real soon. Uh, we have four more shows to go, I think. Um, uh, tomorrow we're heading to Austria, and then Prague, and then Netherlands, that fast. And after that, we'll be heading home take a few breaks and we'll be continuing to the uh, US tour in May mm -hmm. and um, we're touring for the new album Voices so um, I think that's it for this year maybe there's last minute tour coming in I'm not too sure maybe a Japan tour or something I'm, it's still in planning but yeah that's all from us for this year Lost wives. <laughs> 